Today's tutorial is about focusing the camera. To focus our camera, we're going to need several things. We need the ground glass on the back of the camera. We need the lens, a loop, and we also need a dark cloth. Once we have those items ready to go, we're ready to focus and start working on our exposure. The first thing that we need to do to be able to focus the camera is on the lens, we need to make sure that the lens is open. To do that, there's a little switch on the side of the lens. It opens the lens and lets us view through the back um, standard, through the ground glass. But to even be better, just like on the enlarger, to be able to see better, we're going to set the f-stop all the way to f8 on this particular lens, or 5.6 or 2.8 on whatever lens you might have. That way, the larger the opening, the more light I'm getting through the camera and to the back of the camera to be able to see the image. Now let's actually look at focusing the camera. This camera is currently zeroed out. This is how it should look when you take it out of your box and when you put it back into your box. Make sure that all parts of the standard are in its zeroed out position before you put it in the box or you could damage the bellows or the lens or the ground glass. So make sure it's perfectly in position just like this. Next, when we're ready to focus, we're going to loosen this knob down here on the rail. This allows me then to move the lens forward or backward. To actually focus the camera most of the time, I'm going to use only the front standard to focus with. To get my main focus, I'm going to, there's a latch here, I can pull it forward or push it back once I'm pushing that latch. Now once I've set it to the position that I want and get the main focus in, I then can use the knob here to get my micro focus by actually then dialing it in and getting it to perfect focus. I can do the same with the back and once I'm done I want to make sure that I tighten this back down so that it doesn't move. I can also do the same with the back standard. I can loosen it here with the knob once it's loose, I can then use the latch to, man to manually pull it back and forth to, a to actually get a quick focus. Once it's in place, I can then use the knob to move it backward and forward slightly to get better focus. Then I tighten it down once it's focused so that it doesn't actually slip out of place. Of course, then, I could use any of my mo movements on the camera to adjust focus planes and, and uh, tilts and shifts and all of those, and we'll talk about those in another video. But this allows me to get my main focus. So let's take a look at how to focus. So I come to the back of my camera making sure that the lens is in the open position sometimes you have to set the shot you have to set the cock the shutter for certain lenses to actually open uh, the lens so in this case this particular one I have to actually cock the shutter and then set the lens to be open so that's now, the lens is now open and it's at its widest. I can see through the window outside, behind, um, outside, but I want to make sure that the chair in the corner here, which you can't see, is going to be in focus. So I'm going to use my loop and I'm going to set it on the ground glass. Now generally I would put, I would put, this is just for demonstration purposes, I would put the dark cloth over my head to do this, specifically outside. It's a little bit easier when you're in a dark room. And I can then make sure that I loosen my standard and I can pull the focus in until 
my image is nice and sharp. Notice that it didn't move, have to move that far for it to actually get into sharp focus for this particular wide-angle lens. I'm getting a wide view of this room.